you and Ruby have the same coat. They're like, wow, you're here, they're finally here. No, they look at the school bus. Uh, storm. All right, let's go. Good morning, Stella Bell. You guys, today, I'm going riding and the okay. girls aren't. All your hopes and efforts are all in vain. Who will pick you up when you've lost everything? Does it all become for granted? Gracie is loving her stall, you guys. I don't know if it's because it keeps her warm or whatever. I thought she'd freak out, not do well. She's loving it. Uh, all of her horses love their stalls. Little Willow. Little Willow with her blanket on. I love her in a blanket. So many of you guys were like, get Willow a blanket. I was like, I don't want to mess up her coat. Now she's a blanket. I always wanted to get her a blanket. I wanted a cute one, but we couldn't get a cute one. Anyway, it last night, it looks cute on her. I agree. It makes her like smaller. She looks like a little princess, and she thinks she is a little princess. Last night, I had the craziest dream. Like, you guys know how much I believe in my dreams. Gabby, what do you think about my dream? So I told you yesterday that we have two horses to choose from so far to try as soon as we get to try them. Brandon's horse, the gray horse, should be coming soon. Hopefully it should, it'll probably happen maybe before the other one. But this is my dream. I actually was watching Gabby ride and jump the gray horse, Brandon's horse, that he's getting. And I literally, she, it was so amazing that I literally screamed, holy cow, in my sleep. That's, That's not what not. I, <laughs> that is not what I screamed. I screamed something. And I screamed it out loud, know. and I woke myself up screaming it. Like, I woke myself up, then I fell back asleep, I dreamed it again, and heard... Was down there? Uh, yeah, he was sleeping, he didn't hear me. Maybe he <laughs> did hear me. I hear him scream out some crazy things sometimes. <laughs> but yeah, it was that kind of a dream. And so, yeah, like, I'm getting so many signs that a gray horse is gonna be what Gabby's gonna need. So yeah, it could happen. Could happen before Christmas. That'd be good. That'd be good. for him, like a custom saddle. <laughs> no, mine would fit him. Yeah, your saddle would fit him. All right, we uh, fed the horses, cleaned the arena. We're headed up to eat because this girl is starving. Me above zero this whole week. It's gonna be seven degrees by the end of this week. Right yeah, now. Don't fall. Yeah, right now we're any broken bones. no broken bones because I'm gonna ride like the wind today. You guys, you get to Are you choose. Gonna canter? I'm not gonna canter. Are you gonna jump? I'm not gonna jump. I jump, I mean go over a tiny little baby truffle. No, I'm going to truffle. Are you jealous that I'm riding and you're not? No. I'm gonna ride like the wind. You get to choose. You get to choose what you do. No, you do. You get to just choose. Everything you do is a choice. When you decide to fail, it's a choice. When you decide to succeed, it's just it's a choice of never giving up. Oh, it's icy. Riding for me when the girls are there is really stressful. It's I don't like hour-long lessons. I don't have stamina for that. Oh, and me either. Yeah. Not even on pants. No, the girls don't like it either. I'll also, ride Polly. No, I like hour-long lessons. Also, um, it's just stressful trying to get everybody ready and still work on myself. I I don't feel relaxed. So I keep telling Fiona I want to ride on my own. And today that's gonna happen. If you're wondering if I filled the cookie jar like Gabby asked yesterday, then yes, yes, I did. You are so lucky to have a mom like me. Yeah, well, you won't let us eat them. <laughs> so. It's true. I don't just let them eat them whenever they want because they just eat them all and then they'd be all finished, which is probably a good thing, but yeah. <laughs> I love when she shows me up. Yeah. What? Something's been eating that. You think something's been eating that? Yeah, because it wasn't like that. Maybe it's just the cold. Anyway, we are we are in the barn for the afternoon, so we brought our family favorites, man family favorites. Do you like those? Yeah. Yeah. We literally could eat that whole bag right now. We're waiting for the um for the chiropractor. She's gonna do a thin and storm, the horses that we ride. Those are the ones we do every month, and then I do Stella like every other. 
month because we ride her and then after Christmas I think I'm gonna do the ponies because I don't think Will has ever had it done and maybe Gracie not too so um perfect tune-up that's what I consider that a tune-up that all horses that are being ridden should have someday Storm is taller it was Storm that pooped like in some days he's short. Yeah, so Gabby's putting on some hoof flex because, oh, big story, you guys. Anyway, I smelled poop and I'm like, somebody pooped. And the girls are like, it wasn't my horse. It wasn't my horse. Well, you need to clean it before she gets here. Like, we don't want any poop in our barn when the, when the, when company comes. Who's that We're being a butt, so this is going to not be good. Which Do you want a halter on him? Wait, Put a halter no. on him. Okay, yeah, halter. Halter. Mom, if we had a horse that's skinny and ruby, what do you think we'd do? He's gonna feed it. Give him all the food they want. Feed it. Blow a lot if they want. He's like, man. Hey, man. No. He's not awesome with his back feet no. all the time. Sometimes he's like, no problem, and then other times he's a bit of a. The last couple of days he's been a bit of an idiot. But if you saw Sophie's video, then you'll know that that girl found her voice and she found how to tell Finn what to do. Are you still nervous to ride him? Kind of. <laughs> yeah. She comes for me, you guys. Own it. It's okay to be nervous. It's okay to admit to being nervous. What's not okay is not trying. And that's what I tell Sophia all the time. We still gotta try. Still gotta try, right? So after uh, the chiropractor leaves, then uh, it, I'm going riding. So I'm gonna get ready while she's here and be prepared so I can leave as soon as she's gone. Um, I'm riding Denver, hopefully. And my favorite thing to wear when I ride is half chaps, suede half chaps. They're so much more grippy. And Gabby's new boots have suede on the inside. And I told her like, they are, do you find them way more grippy? Half chaps or where is that? Yeah, I like I like my towel boots, but it's just like no friction. Like they just slide on each other. The oh, saddle yeah. and my so boots. So Gracie was at the um store, sticking her head over like she always does, and she was smiling. Aww, she's like, give me carrots. I know you got carrots in there. I'm ice. Yeah, we are frozen. Uh, chiropractor just left. I don't like to video when she's here because one, I like to chat with her. She's really funny, and I she I doesn't stop talking ever. Yeah, we don't stop talking. Long. So I am completely ready. I got all my stuff on. My coat is filthy from the barn. I really did a big cleaning today because yeah, we had somebody coming. This is what nighttime it looks like at our barn. Kind of like all daytime. Usually it's school, but at night it's relax. relax and Roblox. I just wanted on the record that I am ready to go. I am ready. I got my riding gloves. I have riding gloves, you guys. Like that's super impressive. I have my half chaps and my boots on. Um, this is something that I actually have done for me. Like, this is something that I actually said, listen, if I'm going to be serious about my riding, like serious about learning to ride, then I need to do it in a way that I can do it better. It's hard for me to learn when the kids are there. But the problem is, I really like it when they're there to help me tack up. And Fiona messaged me and she said, okay, if you get there before me, do you know where his saddle is and I'm like no I don't even know where his saddle is and she said and just an FYI there will be some little tiny kids like six year olds in the barn when you get there and I'm like yay they could probably help me <laughs> alright tell the truth am I late because of this no did you go get donuts not, I'm early actually no I have to be there in 30 minutes and we're 40 minutes away well that's not my problem I'm done at 3.30 so where'd you get the donuts work, work? Right, let's see. Oh, Girls are missing out. Turn on the heat. Oh, these are these are Wanamaker donuts. There's bacon on that. Is that maple bacon? Mmm, yeah. which one do you guys think I'm gonna choose? Coconut. That one's strawberry cream though. This one. I can't remember if I told you guys what the what the chiropractor said. She said that um, Finn was looking good. He's a, like a much nicer weight. He looks like a horse now. He um, every time she adjusts him, he looks better and better. She said that he 
has better symmetry, he has better balance, he's got better, like everything is a lot better. She said that he was out his l lower right lumbar, like his back kind of above his hip. Um, that has always been his issue, like that's always been the part of him that he kind of gets tight in when anything happens. And um, I know when we bought him, I kept saying he looks off in the back, he looks off in the back and it's just that tight spot in his in his hips or his pelvis or whatever that is anyway so he was tight there again in the last week and a half or so he's been kind of funny about us picking up his back feet he's been giving us more trouble before that he's been really really good so i kind of been starting to get an idea of when he's starting to get tight or he's starting to get out and then storm was really good too he always has like a little bit of a tightness in his neck and sometimes in his pelvis and sometimes in his shoulders like it just depends this time it was a little bit in his neck but his back and his pelvis all was all good they both adjusted really well uh, she's pleased with them but like I said before we do chiropractic as a preventative we do it just to maintain and take care of our horses backs because we use their backs and I find it definitely helps with our horses we are exactly on time I ride at 4 30 we're here at 4 p.m. You guys, look at our field. In another week, this is where our horses are gonna be. It's not done, I don't think. They're gonna put uh, wood chips on it. And they put more sand, and they're gonna probably level it out. Hopefully they do it before it freezes. Yeah, they better do it before. So this water trough here is what they feed these horses. So we'll be able to put our hay in there. We need to get another one though. So, funny story, I gotta go get Denver's halter trying to get ready fast anyways funny story today i was teasing the girls like ha ha i'm riding you're not like sometimes parents gotta have fun that's the only joy i get in my life sometimes is teasing my kids so i was teasing them and then later in the day sophie's like do you care if i text fiona and i'm like sure so she texts fiona and she's like what horse is my mom riding today because she wanted Fiona to say I was riding Polly, <laughs> but I'm riding Denver. Come here. There he is, way down there. Coming out, close the door. Whoa! He's freaking out. He's freaking out. You freaking out? He's freaking out. You freaking out? You want to go too? Ah, oh, poor guy. Poor guy, freaking out. Of course, Laura leaves me here with the other horse freaking out. He's still freaking out. He wants to go. Freaking out still. 
still freaking out. Here they come. Come on. It's dark in here. He's a rookie. Let him adjust his eyes for a bit. Hey. <laughs> what do you want me to do? I don't know. Hold the camera or hold the horse. <laughs> Alright, I gotta put the camera down. I just had flashbacks of when I took Gabby and Laura to the farm to see this small little pony and the big humongous horse charged at me. Flashbacks. And this is a small compared to the horse that charged me. I don't know if I'm supposed to take this off over his head. No, I take it off. But I'm not going to unbuckle him. I can't unbuckle this one. Alright, I got it. Usually when things get crazy, Sam like gets mad and starts screaming at me because I'm doing something wrong, which I'm usually doing something wrong. But I brought him in, and Sam was still outside, and he was acting crazy, man, like crazy. Like he was knocking everything over and trying to drag me, and I was like, okay, let's go back outside. And then Sam finally came in and we brought him in, and he's like, when's Fiona getting here? I'm terrified, he actually said, I'm terrified. Yeah, that's what happens when you leave this alone in the barn with a huge horse. And this is why like, I don't think I'm ready for a big, huge horse. I was just a little girl when my mama used to say. Ooh. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Stop being a butt. <laughs> Did you guys hear that? You got gas? All right, we are home from the barn, and Sophie is going down with Sam to do chores. Sophie's night. Gabby is exactly where I left her. Gabby, where's Kaylee? Um, 
sick. She's sick? Wow, you know she's sick when she's not on the computer. Be oh, she was, and then her mother told her to stop. So I guess if you're sick, you've got to stop. But anyway, um, we're home, and I'm going to make some supper. We stopped at the grocery store and got some baby spinach because I really want to have um, a smoothie. I really want to have a smoothie for breakfast. Um, I'm going to make supper, and but, but before I end out, I'm going to make supper while Sam goes down. And before I end out the video, I wanted to tell you guys, like, today I was actually learning to ride a horse. I was actually learning to ride a horse. Not just sitting there, going around in circles, trying to figure it out. I was learning. And I'm 50, you guys. And I'm 50. Like, I just want to tell you guys. If there is something out there in this life that you want to do, that you just like, you just want to do it, but you don't know how to get there, get out there and do it because you're never going to get this chance again. Go out there and do what you want to do now while you can. Like, if I can do this, you guys, you can do it. Anyway, that is it for today. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.